And let's have a look at the latest stats from the Hurricane Center. You know, this kind of surprised me. Still at 115 miles per hour. This was as of 8 a.m. Eastern. Uh, we'll see. I bet the next advisory they'll bring it down. I've seen some satellite estimates that have it closer to about 100 miles per hour. So uh, regardless, the good news in some sense, in a way, is that it's stationary. The core of whatever is left of uh, Raymond is still offshore. It's out here. Still, maybe the hurricane force winds are about 50 miles offshore. So those aren't getting any closer, but the other part of the stationary movement is that it's still bringing a lot of rain to those same places that have gotten a lot of rain already, uh, not far from Acapulco. Looking at the water vapor imagery, you can see it's kind of gotten a little bit more ragged in the last several hours. See this bronze shading on here? There's a lot of dry air at many levels of the atmosphere, and some of that's getting in there, no doubt, into the circulation. So that is, I think, eroding it just a little bit. Looking at a uh, webcam from Acapulco, you know, it doesn't look too bad. I know the sun isn't up, so you can't see a whole lot. But what you can see is the lights on the horizon. Uh, that suggests that it's not raining hard right now anyway, and the waves don't appear to be too big, and the winds aren't blowing those trees around a whole lot, at least for now. Uh, Raymond forecast tracks each one of these lines is a different model forecasting it to basically move not very much over the next you know few hours, but then by tonight and tomorrow, it's going to be heading west away from Mexico. Good news for them because they need a break. They're going to get this much more rainfall, I think, out of it, maybe three to five in places along, say, from Acapulco to Zihuatanejo. And, uh, you know, they're, that's on top of what they've had yesterday. So a lot of rain for them. And let's look at the bigger picture. Now, it's really quiet over the Gulf of Mexico, Caribbean Sea, and Western Atlantic. You can actually see Raymond right in there. And look. You can see some uh, water vapor aloft, some of that streaming uh, northeastward on jet stream, very close to this little small tropical storm out there, Lorenzo, in the middle of the Atlantic. That's going to be moving away from the United States. No threat to us. Good news there.